Hello and welcome to another Good Mouth Monday, and that's the day where we sing the praises of someone who deserves more credit, someone who inspires us, someone who's making this world more beautiful, and today I have a very special person. It's also a little bit sad, but you'll find out why, because this person continues to inspire me, but she's no longer with us. When I look for inspiration and ideas, I tend to go outside of my voiceover bubble. I'm a voice actor, in case you didn't know that. Because if you've been around the voiceover community for a while, it becomes kind of an echo chamber. Don't get me wrong, it's a nice community, wonderful people, but there's only so much we can talk about. But I am interested in the voice and in those who use their voice professionally. I've always been fascinated by opera singers, their ability to memorize long performances and how they manage to reach the last seat in the house without a microphone. How do they do that? And they do this for hours. On the flip side, one of the things I hate most is when young kids are made to perform complicated arias on talent shows. I'm sure you've seen them on TV. They have no business singing adult material because they cannot bring any depth to the performance. And secondly, their voices have not yet matured, and if you don't coach these kids carefully, instead of exploiting them, they risk damaging their vocal folds. Now, one of the few singing kids that managed to have a career won a show called Talent Mania in Slovakia when she was only 12 years old. It's like the X Factor or America's Got Talent. Her name is Patricia Janečkova. She started singing when she was four years old, and after primary school she was so good she went straight to the local conservatory. At age 13 she released her first album, and the next year she won a singing competition in Rome. After graduation she kept on studying privately, gradually taking on more ambitious projects and crossing over to different styles. Her career is one of carefully preparing her instrument for the big roles and operatic stages of the world. Apart from having an angelic voice and great vocal technique, Patricia has poise, plenty of charisma, she can act and she's not hard to look at. So why is she still relatively unknown, you may wonder? Well, in February of last year she was diagnosed with breast cancer and had to stop performing. Let me bring her back up, because that, this is Patricia, in case you were wondering. Initially, the treatment seemed successful, and after a mastectomy, she married the love of her life in June of this year. But soon after, the aggressive cancer came back, and Patricia died on the 1st of October, age 25. Lucky for us, she's left many recordings on YouTube. I did not know her personally, but I feel like I've lost a friend and I mourn her passing with deep sadness. So Patricia, this Good Mouth Monday is for you. Rest in peace.